guys, what is going on? Ligatetsu9 here, and welcome back to another episode of the Purge SMP server, guys. I apologize that there's not been a purge out in like a week, guys, but right now I am uh, running back over to my base. Basically what happened in between episodes is I decided that we are going to be moving our base, so we're going to be going to a new spot, and right now on my other monitor, uh, I'm looking at the coordinates to my base because I lost where I was going. Uh, as I was coming back from spawn, because I was going to check out the progress that DJ has made to spawn. Uh, he hasn't made much yet, uh, but he should be working on it soon. Also, guys, there may be the group nether event this week, so get excited for that. But I went to check out the progress that he'd been making on spawn. He's done quite a bit so far, and I'm really impressed. Hopefully, it'll come out really nice. At least, that's the hope. So, so he's shown us some screenshots of what he's trying to base spawn off of, and it looks like it could be really cool. So, I'm looking forward to that. And, guys, we're going to be running back to our base right here. And I'm going to be showing you guys, I've worked on a house. I've worked on a farm. I even have a dock set up. So, we're almost there. So, the house is right here. So, if we come out here, this is the house uh, so far, so I will give you a little bit of a tour. Uh, I'm going for a very old Minecraft kind of style here. I want to build a house, a dock, all that kind of cool stuff. I just want to make this place look really nice, and we have to go inside and cook up this raw beef here. So we can head in and cook this up. We will, actually what we'll do is, we'll split the stack, so if we can just grab that. Yep, we will split the stack here, and we will place the other one in here. Now my house, guys, this is my, this is the main, the main area of my house. So, we started off, I have not moved my chests in. Probably what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a, sky, a spiral staircase down uh, into the ground, and from there, there will be my chest room. And if you guys are longtime viewers of my channel, you'll remember that back on Gold Guild Season 2, I had a house similar to this. I built a spiral staircase down, and that led to my chest room. So, I'm going to be going for that design again. I think it's going to be pretty cool. I've always loved uh, living in spruce forests. These are kind of, these are some of, my, some of my favorite biomes, so I've always loved living in these. And the, the house is just going to be, it's going to be really cool, I think. The next thing is we have my farm. So the farm is not done yet. I still have to make a few of the fences. And we can go ahead and make the fences now as I talk. But that is going to be my, my farming area for the service. We can use, we can use dark oak and sticks. So let's just grab that. Uh, this is going to be my farm. Uh, currently, it is only a wheat farm. I will plan, I do plan on upgrading it later. But if I remember correctly, this is how you make fences. These are spruce fences. We need to go and cut down oak trees. But uh, it's currently only a wheat farm. Uh, probably as the farm gets better. Actually, before we go and grab the oak wood, let's go ahead and grab some more steak. But as the farm improves, I'm going to be upgrading it. I'll cut down more trees and I will add more farms in the future. We're lagging a bit here, guys. I do apologize. I was going to record an SG today. But I'm lagging a bit right now. So I figured, hey, purge is better. I won't have to deal with getting killed by lag. But we will get rid of trees later, and I will put more farms in, like a carrot farm, potato farm, maybe eventually a pumpkin and melon farm once we have enough, enough of a sustainable food source. And I will probably add in some animal farms in the future as well. What is it? Was that a cave sound? I could have sworn I just heard a cave sound come through my headset, but I don't know. But that'll probably be in the future. We will work on making animal farms. There's a ton of pigs and cows in the forest. So as long as I don't kill enough of them before we make the farm, we should be good to create it. And it should be fun. It should be really cool. So I think if we make that into planks, yeah, 14, 14 oak logs is going to do it for us. We should be good now. And we can finish off the farm. I will have to make, is that one or two? Let's count that before we make anything. There's one on that side already. So there's going to be one here. So it's going to be one fence gate in the center. All right. So we will remember to do that. And now we can go ahead and make the fences and fence gates. Also, guys, as you could tell by looking at the dock and the farm and my house, um, they're made of different wood types. So let's make let's make the fence gate first before we do anything. Uh, we could use oak wood. Good, we got the fence gate. And now we can do is we can make the fences. We only need like six, so that's good. We don't want to make too many, and we can place these down, and our farm will be complete. Which is very nice. So one here, one here, one here. And finally, we have the oak gate. Very nice. So the farm is now pretty much done. Now, what I want to check is, do we have any bone meal in our chest? If we do, we have some. Okay, so we can make bone meal. And we can grow some of these plants, which will be cool. And then we can harvest a few and get some more harvesting going. We'll grow the ones that are almost done. Like so. Got that one. That one. That one. And that one. And then we can do a few more. Let's just use up. Let's use up all the bone meal on these plants. Oh, we just did not mean to do that. We bone mealed the outside grass, and that caused more tall grass and flowers to grow. So we can get rid of those. We might actually have enough to finish all of these. 
Oh no, we're not going to. We're gonna have we're gonna be one short, but we can make a harvest here, which is very good. So the farm, once we get going and once I'm on here working a lot more, the farm is gonna grow and it's gonna become much more efficient. And that's gonna be cool. Now, also, guys, a few updates. Uh, if you guys are watching, you purge people are gonna get some special updates because you guys have said there are a few of you that only watch one of my series, like a few people watch purge but don't watch survival games. A few people watch SG but don't watch purge. So I'm gonna give you guys a special hint. I'm gonna be upgrading my audio software. As well as my, um, as well as my, I'm editing, not editing software, but sort of like my recording. I'm going to be getting an overlay intro. Uh, Skid should be done with my drawn banner this week because this is the week he gets back. So he should be done with that, which is pretty neat. And it's, yeah, it's, it's an exciting time. It's a very cool time. Actually, let's do this now. Let's move my chest room inside. That way I don't have to deal with going outside constantly. So we will make another double chest to put in here. That way we can just transfer all the items. For now, we'll put the chest here, and we will begin to bring all the stuff over. How much inventory space do we have? We are pretty good. This one's going to break this, so we can grab as much stuff as possible. Good, and we can just begin to uh, transfer all of the stuff onto my into the inside of my house, and that should be good. So let's just work on getting all this in. I'm not 100% sure, sure how much is left in the chest, so we can go ahead and check that out right now once we drop in these fences. So let's check how many stuff is left, how much is left in here. Pretty much a full chest. Let's just mine this and let's just take it all. Can we pick it all up? Yes, we can. Very good. All right, let's head back in. And then now that we have... Where's that other chest? Now that we have two chests, we can set up... I believe I put one in here. Yes, I did. We can put two chests here. So if we run out of space in one, we can just put the rest on top, which is very cool. Also, guys, um, the audio interface is getting an upgrade. I'm going to be getting like some really like fancy stuff. I won't say what yet. But once I do upgrade my audio, I might do an updated setup tour at the end of the summer. That's maybe like an end of the end of the summer special I might do. And we can actually harvest a bunch of this stuff as well. But that might be like an end of the summer uh, special I might do. Or maybe I'll do it for 2,000 subscribers because we are, we're almost to eight, we're getting close to 1,800. So we're almost to 2K. My goal by the end of the summer is 2,000 subscribers. So if we can do it, that would be absolutely amazing. And if we do... I'll probably do the setup tour for 2k. I'm planning. I don't have too many specials in mind. We have no room in there. I don't have many specials in mind yet for the 2k subscriber special. I did a ton of, and I, I know I made this mistake by doing them all for 1k, but for 1k, I did a setup tour, a Q&A, and a thank you vlog, and I'll probably do a setup tour for 2k, and maybe, maybe if I can get the, maybe if I can get all the logistics done, maybe I'll release this pack here, if we go into resource packs, uh, this pack here, I might release it. This is the Linky 1029 official pack that I've been working on for a little bit now. It's just an edit of, a bunch of edits of different packs. As you can see, uh, we've got Huawei's, um, inner GUI, solar flares, um, edited crosshair, some different blocks from a few other packs, and some bow and some swords from another pack, like some HD bow and HD swords. So I might release this for 2K. I don't know. If you guys like it, maybe I'll release it for 2K, but it's ultimately up to you. I'm not using it right now because it's not completely done, and I want to wait a little bit longer before I make any changes to it because I want to see what I like. And I honestly, I'm a default guy. I really enjoy default the most. So I might make a few edits to this. I might make maybe an HD version of the pack and then a default edit version and maybe like a really faithful version of the pack, like maybe change like one or two things. Because honestly, default is my favorite pack in Minecraft. I love default. It just feels like Minecraft, and it's really neat. So, did we eat that? Oh, yes, we did. Okay, good. We're getting getting some um, some FP, not FPS lag, um, some connection lag, which is annoying. But also, if you guys have been paying attention, Minecon happened yesterday and today. So, uh, basically what they did is, at a panel, Mojang showed off some of the new 1.8 features. If you guys don't know, 1.8 is the PvP update, and I am just so excited. Actually, what we can do is we can go ahead and work on filling in the top here but mojang announced well it didn't they didn't announce they showed off some really neat stuff for the 1.8 update it's looking really good there's all these new arrow types they teased a shield they teased so many awesome things and 1.8 is and there's also a new mob in the end all i can say is 1.8 is shaping up to be a 1.9 is shaping up to be a really nice update and i'm very excited for it and i want to get your feedback what do you guys think of the 1.9 update. Are you guys excited? If you guys are PvP people, do you think this is going to ruin PvP? 
Do you think it's going to improve PvP? I would love to know what you guys think about it, because me personally, I think PvP needs some sprucing up. Maybe this update will add more game modes into PvP. I'm not sure. They could honestly do anything with this update, but I'm very much looking forward to it, because I think it's going to add... It's going to breathe some new life into Minecraft PvP-wise, and just in general. And this... We might replace these with blocks. Hang on, let's see. I gotta get used to the chest being in here, but we might replace those with... Do we have glass blocks? Yes, we do. I want to see how this looks here, quickly. Because it's solid. Does that... No, that doesn't look good. Never mind, I don't like that. Let's grab... We can put those back and grab these. But one thing I do want to test is... Can we grab these? Thank you. Thank you. I want to put them... I want to put them on the inside. And then... Put the panes here. Does that... That doesn't do anything. So, actually, I don't like that. Let's get rid of that. Let's just put them back how they used to be. Here and here. It's not going to change anything. So, I guess that's... That's that. And, do we have any torches? Because we can go ahead and put some lighting in the house now. Uh, we already have torches. Nice. So, we can put one here and one here. And yeah, that basically lights up the whole room, which is really nice. Can you fix internet, please? I'll just shut you myself. Is it raining? It's raining out. But, yeah, guys, I think that's going to do it. For today's episode of the Purge SMP server, if you all enjoyed, please sure leave a comment down below. Audio is going to be so nice pretty soon, guys. I'm going to be start. I'm going to start using Audacity to record my audio. I'm going to be getting an XLR mic, an audio interface, all this cool stuff. It's going to be exciting. I might get another monitor as well. Kind of have two monitors. Maybe stash away the laptop and store it and use it kind of like a desktop. I already use it mainly as a desktop, but we will see. So anyway, I hope you all enjoyed today's episode of The Purge SMP. We'll probably have another episode of Purge out Wednesday or Thursday because I feel bad because a lot of you guys really enjoy the series, so I want to bring you guys more content from it. I just, I've been working kind of off camera and everything, so it's really cool. We're also working on switching hosts right now, so it's it's a lot of stuff going on. There's going to be a ton of Purge stuff coming up, guys, so look forward to it. A lot of cool events and stuff, so be on the lookout for that in the next coming weeks. Hope you all enjoyed, and as always, I've been Lincoln1029, and we'll see you all in the next video.